Now, Gab, uh, Arsenal and Manchester United can't have all the fun in this transfer window. Chelsea want in on the action. They're uh, supposedly looking for a new striker. It's a search that seems to be leading them in some unlikely directions. Uh, what's, what's the very latest? Yeah, so Chelsea, obviously, they were linked with, uh, with Andy Carroll. Um, Carroll's injury and maybe the fact that he's Andy Carroll sort of uh, <laughs> put that one to rest. Uh, there's a story uh, tomorrow in one of the papers saying that they're going to go after Peter Crouch, who uh, turns 37 soon. Um, there's talk uh, out of Italy that Roma have received a bid of, uh, of $50 million, uh, for uh, for Edin Dzeko, uh, but Roma holding out for more. Uh, so it seems to be a pretty scattershot approach, but... You know, worth remembering, uh, Chelsea's director of football, Michael Emanalo, left in November. And, and I think at this stage, they're probably kind of paying the price for that. Mm. Seems a little bizarre, guys, doesn't it? <laughs> well, let's be honest. Of the three, it's an absolute <laughs> well, no-brainer mm. that you go for Ed and Dzeko. Mm. The other two are just... I mean, quite frankly, never mind Chelsea. Why would you sign Andy Carroll? He never plays. He's never fit. Oh, shock, horror. He's injured. Wow, really? <laughs> and then I just don't believe the crouchy one. No. So it's a no-brainer. He's nearly 37. That would be extraordinary. I mean, it's, it's no wonder that Roma are holding out. They can afford to do so. I think Dzeko, since he's been, been to Roma, I think he's been fantastic. He's done yeah. really, really well there. So it makes sense for, for Conte to go after him. But mm. Roma are quite right. They can hold out for as much money as possible. No, you're right. When the competition is Crouch and Carroll, you hold yeah. off for more. No, no, no question at all. <laughs> Gab, would, would Roma actually let Jekko go? I don't think so. I mean, obviously, uh, you know, Roma are, are uh, you know, they're still the Champions League. They, they want to finish top four. Um, you know, 50 million is, is, is a would be, if the reports are accurate, I should stress. I, I haven't been able to confirm this. Um, you know, wouldn't necessarily be a bad price given uh, Jekko's age. Um, but by the same token, you know, Roma would need to scramble for a replacement. Chelsea couldn't use him in Europe. And I think generally from Chelsea's perspective, and this is why you're hearing about guys like Crouch and Carroll, uh, I'm not sure they want to get tied into making a big financial commitment to somebody when they're not 100% sure Antonio Conte is going to be back next year. Why, why do they need a big target guy? That's obviously what they're going after. Why? Uh, I think because Conte likes one. Mm. Well, he just wants somebody who can be the focal point yep. and then everybody Some, else can join in. It'll be somebody a, different. It'll be and, bit, something different from what they have. It'll be a backup for Murata as well, just to, just to spell him a little bit. How would you feel if you're Bashway? <laughs> <laughs>